hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video i am discussing about the what is the singleton class in c sharp and how we will create this class and how we will use this class so singleton class is a design pattern which means it's a design pattern and it's a creational creational design pattern which means we only deals with the creation of an object so it's a singleton class or singleton design pattern is falls into the creational design pattern it means we deal the singleton in which we create an object of this class so why this uh, that the region of singleton class that has been falls into the creational design pattern so singleton is a class in which we create only and only one instance no more than one instance has been created in a singleton, singleton class and it we restricted to this class to be only create an one instance in our entire application if we want to implement a logic that has been uh, used in a only and only one instance then we will use singleton class and it's the best way to use singleton class to be used that logic in that rather than creating a multiple instances of the class for example in our database we have a connection pool and a connection pool have a, a, a multiple connections and if one ever request comes to the database a connection pools find the connection available connection from the connection pool and return this uh, to the caller and here is the uh, concept of a singleton class we will use connection pool as a singleton it means we will create a connection pool class that has been only and only one instance so this only one instance used in our entire application and no more than one instance must be used to be implement this logic so our work has been done by using only one instance and that the way using a we have a singleton design pattern this is the beauty of our programming code or program structure that has been used by using the design pattern so in c sharp we will create a singleton design pattern by the following structure in singleton is it's a general design pattern and has been created by using a different uh, languages but but in c sharp we use uh, this coding to be implemented as singleton design pattern first of all i create a class singleton class just like a normal class we are creating then i create a object property why i will create a object property because of that in a locking mechanism for the multi threading i use this log object to be log so that why i create a log uh, this object then i create a property instance where our uh, singleton object has been stored stored and uh, then i will create a i has been create a singleton private constructor for that a uh, user cannot create an object explicitly for example if we, i create a singleton object then it does not allow me to be create because of this private constructor and it restricted to be does not need to be create a instance of the class so this is the reason of creating a private constructor then i will create then i, I create a static method and this method has an actual logic to be return the singleton object only one object and if a request come to this method first first request come to this method and it finds the instance is equal to null then it enters into the this block lock block and lock block lock the uh, object it will hold the object and enter into th into this block second time it it will check instance is equal to null yes instance is equal to null and then it will create an instance of the object and return to the caller and second object second request has been come and then it will find instance is not equal to null because of that we have instance uh, already created and this condition false uh, and thread cannot be uh, enter into this block and return the sing, uh, instance to the caller and then multiple thousand objects or request has been occurred in this block every time it will condition check 
it it will not equal to null and every time this condition falls and return the instance so this is the one case and in second case in our multi threading application if multiple object come into this block first object check if instance is equal to null yes instance is equal to null in first time then it will enter into this block the second object also come at the same time instance is equal to null and then it will uh, enter into the same block then two thread has been entered into this if condition into this condition and then first thread go ahead and enter into this lock lock statement and then lock statement will lock this object to be make sure that only one object a thread has been entered into this particular block and th uh, then second thread try to enter into this block but lock thread will not enter the second thread into this block because of that already one thread has been entered into this and how we will check because of this this object block object state of this object to check this and the second thread uh, try to enter enter into this block then this lock block has been checked if the object is locked then it will not enter into, into this block so first thread already entering this block and second thread wait for the enter into, into this block until the first thread has been exist so first thread check that instance is equal to null yes instance is equal to null and it will create instance then return after that if first thread exists into this block lock statement release the lock from the obj object and second thread then enter into the block then it has the chance to enter into this block second thread will enter into this block and then second thread will check if instance is equal to null no instance is not equal to null because of that first thread already created an instance and this condition falls and this condition falls and second thread will release the uh, 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 go uh, exist from the log statement and go to work and in this scenario multiple thousand of obje objects has been request has been occurred and every time this condition is false and the instance is returned to null so this is the proper way of using singleton design pattern or singleton class that has been only and only one instance to be created and no more than one instance to be created we restrict this uh, method to be create only one instance by using double checking which means we check first time here and then we check first time here to make sure that only one instance has been created in this block so this is the proper way of using singleton design pattern in a c sharp how, how we will create a singleton design pattern in c sharp i hope you uh, understand this please like my video if you not understand this please post a comment and i will answer here for you Thanks.